it's okay. All right, here with Andrea <laughs> Lee. Um, started out nine pars, uh, made a few more pars on the front nine, which is your back nine today, and then finished really well. Had five birdies in like six or seven holes. Just walk me through that uh, those last few. Yeah, I played really well coming down the stretch. I had to stay really patient on like the first, you know, 13 holes on uh, just made par and I was getting a little bit frustrated, but, um, you know, I was hitting good shots. So I knew that the birdies would come at some point and they did at the very end, um, birdie five of my last six holes. So that was um, really nice to finish the way I did. Just walk me through some of those birdies and those uh, those last six. Oh my gosh, to be honest, I don't even remember. <laughs> um, I just hit some really solid shots. Um, I think two par threes coming down the stretch, um, just hit, one to about nine feet, the other to about eight feet, made those and then took advantage of the um, par five that was reachable in two. Actually had like probably a 12 footer for Eagle and just missed that. Um, and then, and then yeah, the last two, I didn't even expect it. Um, you know, after the three in a row, I just wanted to have a strong finish and um, came out with two more. So um, yeah, really happy with the way I played. Uh, played last week at Evian. Um, coming to this week, what adjustments did you make in your game to kind of a, get ready for links? Yeah, I think just um, practicing a lot of uh, punch shots, um, kind of low trajectory into the wind because during the practice round on Tuesday anyway, um, it was blowing pretty good out here. Um, today we actually had really nice conditions, so I'm glad that I took advantage of that, but I think the wind will definitely pick up the next few days. So um, yeah, just practiced a lot of uh, knockdown shots, uh, trying to prepare for that and um, getting used to the green speeds, but the course is in great condition. Um, so. Yeah, so I, I love Lynx golf, so it's been fun. You've been out of school a while, but I know you probably played some of these kind of similar conditions while you were in college. I mean, not true Lynx, but cold, wet, windy. Um, did that, does that having that experience help you at all? Yeah, definitely. I mean, being from LA, I'm a, I'm a wimp in the cold, to be really honest. Like, um, I would rather take the heat any day. Um, but yeah, I, I think playing at, playing at Stanford, we had some cold weather. And um, actually, our coach is from Scotland. So we took a team trip to Scotland, um, I think, my junior year. And we played tons of Lynx courses. We played Kings Barnes, Gullen, uh, North Berwick. So. Um, I really love Lynx golf, so just having those experiences have kind of helped me, I guess, the last few years playing um, in the Scottish and the British Open. Uh, just final question, mindset kind of heading into the rest of the week after this good start. Yeah, I think just um, staying really, really patient like I did today. Um, you know, the birdies may or may not come, but just got to, you know, keep my head down and hit good shots, hit, hit fairways and greens and try to make some putts, um, not worry what, about what other girls are doing and just hopefully have a strong finish.